Crazy Seti. Crazy Seti's advantage is that he literally has like at least 10 characters at his disposal and he can play at a high level. Where is he going to? Jackie. Distract to Jackie because he knows that players do not know how to compete with Jackie. Sonic Fox has been beating everybody with Rachel, so he's going to go with what he's comfortable with Rachel. The key to this matchup is simple. You need to make sure Rachel stays on her back. If she gets offensively on you, especially yeah. in the hands of Sonic Fox, you're going to have a hard time dealing with that. What makes Rachel so dangerous is that when she hits you, then they're all the same. Yeah. Every character becomes Every the same. Character Matchup becomes goes out the same. window, yep. and then it's just Absolutely. Rachel playing Rachel's game. Yep, and here we go. Guaranteed, that's two hits. 15% great sidestep by Crazy Steady. He's known for his sidestep ability. Wow, very nice throw. Very nice throw. And just like that, a couple pokes, and we already have Rachel dead. Wow, staying quick on her, quick jabs. Yeah. And, and, and Jackie. He also has the neutral punch parry. Oh, yeah. Yeah, neutral punch parry. And, and Jackie has so he has the most strings outside of Alpha. He has the most strings in the game. High, low mix-up for days. A high counter throw. Yeah. Great yeah. damage. And you know, one of the weaknesses of Sonic Fox that I noticed in Injustice as well as this is that when he's on the defensive, he kind of sometimes he'll panic a little bit and throw out some unnecessary moves. Yeah. Wow. And, and, and just like that, I mean, Crazy said he is totally dictating this match. This is a guaranteed forward kick, punch, kick. Wow. I didn't know you could slow escape that. That was amazing. So there you but are, Soul Mixing Escape. Sonic Fox up. Sonic Fox just cannot get anything Jesus, going he's here. He's trying to get off the ground. He's having such a hard time. There's that 360 frame stun move, and Crazy Steady is slow escaping ridiculously quick. Gonna pick him up. Yep, go for that blender. Now here comes the blender, plus 15. Ooh, go great duck by Sonic. You, you know how Travis I feel Sonic. about going for throws. Oh. I don't, I always believe. Feed him the strikes, feed it to him. Well, you know what it is? You know what it is? She had her forward forward kick is plus four on block. Yeah. And it's a launching, it's, it's the same move as uh, Spartan's forward forward kick. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah, so I mean, we, you really need to see that. That's one of the stances from Rachel. She sidesteps, punch punch sidestep, going for that blender again. And I don't know if Crazy said he knows that he can back tech. He can back tech out of that. That's not guaranteed. He may not. He may not know. Oh, uh, you know, but there is times today where I did see that where like no one could get out of it. So maybe on certain weight classes, I haven't tested it enough, but maybe on certain weight classes it is guaranteed. Maybe? Oh, very oh, nice. Oh, yeah. Launching mid-kick hold. Forward punch punch into that air grab. He's going to follow it up. Go with the guaranteed. See, there's the back tech. Wow. A great, great hold. hold. There. All right. Put him right in front of him, and he grabbed. Wow. And Crazy Steady is known for having people's number. Honestly, I know as, uh, as crazy as that might sound, he is so good at studying people. And he is so good at just being able to read on the fly that exactly what you see there. 3 0. 3 0. Sonic Fox also going to Christy now. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. He knows that he needs to switch. That was way, 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 way too convincing of a loss. He just basically stood there and kept getting punched for the most part. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> Gotta make something happen here. Now for business. Uses the cat outfit, Christy. Yeah, cat outfit, Christy. Now, Sonic nice. Fox plays totally different than his brother. There's yeah. that critical burst. We're going to see some crazy Christy combos trying to get into that wall. In Dead or Alive 5, you never want your back to the wall in any fighting game. Yeah, never. Never. So we're going to see if Sonic Fox can lock Jackie in, but Jackie has so many mix-ups. Dead or Alive 5 is reminiscent of DOA 2, where the wall it's one of the most unforgiving walls. In this game, there's certain stunts animations on the wall, just like in DOA 2 where they would sit down on their butt. When you sit down on your butt, there is nothing you can do. You're done. You have to attempt, preemptively guess what's going to happen. Here comes that Jackie mix-up, and Christie's known for just a billion strikes. This is anyone's game here. Oh, mixes him up with the low. Goes into the uh, snake stance, catches him with the low. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, here we go. I mean, what's going to happen here? Is Sonic Fox's Christie going to be able to do the mix-up? Is he going to be able to hold and get out of these Jackie mix-ups? I don't think anybody knows Jackie right now, and that's really crazy said he's advantage. Yeah, but which is why Sonic Fox goes to Christie. You know what? He wants to be on the offensive. He realizes he's not going to have much success on the defensive end right, here. Right. You know what? Rachel's a little too slow to deal with Jackie. Yes. So he figures the, the quickness of Christie will be able to really help him here, and this yes. is going to be game. Sonic Fox on fire right now. Absolutely. He's taking Absolutely. him apart. He's taking Absolutely. him apart. And he really needed this because Crazy said he was looking invincible five minutes ago. Yeah. Uh-oh, high counter throw. That is one of Jackie's most uh, gar uh most high damage throws. And oh man, just slowly playing that stun game. Crazy said he's just slowly playing it, trying to milk exactly any sort of damage he can. Wow, he's in a lot of he's in a lot. Of, Sonic Fox in cover this round. Yeah, that, ooh, that's oh, it. Oh, and he takes it. Man, two one. 2-1. Got to get something going he's here. He's got to get something going. I mean, he does have a set advantage on Sonic Fox, but still, you want to eliminate him as yeah, quick you as don't possible. Yeah, you don't ever want to go to the last game because yeah. any, it's yeah. anybody's game. And yeah. watching Sonic Fox all day, he's another one. He gets rolling on an offensive yeah. tear, and you are in trouble. But here comes Crazy Steady. There's a three-kick wow, finisher. Sonic Fox. Wow, wow crazy what a Crazy Steady. 
crazy steady, Got man. Got all the momentum right now. All and the momentum. Sonic Fox, and he's not backing off. Oh, guaranteed back turn combo. Here it goes into that stance again. Only 20%, but just getting in his head. What a hold. Wow, what a hold. And just like that, Sonic Fox is relentless on the offensive. High counter, man. Got a slugfest going on right yeah, now. Yeah, you know in DOA, you don't want to be in a high counter situation. You never. Oh, ever, man. Absolutely never. So dangerous. So dangerous. Sonic Fox is in a lot of trouble right oh, here. Man, back to the wall. He's trying to get out of there. There's that stun right there. Crazy putty. Oh, oh what a hold! hold! To punish. He doesn't punish. He would have killed oh. him. He would have killed him with the throw punish. Myself and Alan Paris were commentating yesterday. We were talking about that all day long. These people, they're not throw punishing. He would have killed them. A lot of DOA players, they don't realize the damage of their throw, and they want the mix-up on strike more so than the throw. But you've got to take your guarantees in you this have game. To. Right now, Sonic Fox would be going home if Crazy Steady just throw punished. I really can't stress it enough. On to the next set here. We have Christy. Oh, guaranteed back turn combo. Down punch, punch. Punch, punch, kick. Mix up into that electric wall. Ooh, I thought I was going to knock him in. Oh, another throw punish miss. He's going for the stun game mix up. But right there, he did four pokes instead of throwing on a back turn combo. Yeah. Sonic Fox is back on fire again now. Yeah, he, he, when he gets tearing with Christy and doing the stances like that, oh boy, are you in trouble. Yeah, There's that low. He's got to slow him down. And, and right here, you know, we're seeing Crazy Steady. Oh, this is gonna kill! Into the wall! Wow. wow. That was and there's tremendous. the advantage of that power blow. In Dead or Alive 5, when your life bar is flashing, that means power blow is active, and you do not want to get hit with that. Guaranteed launch. Oh, camera switches. Ah, yeah, camera switches. Messed up the, he messed up uh, his combo. Okay, here's that tear. We have Crazy Steady holding a little oh, too wow. much here. Right there, that was what you hold. Oh, wow, that was so nice. Again, missing that guaranteed punish. He's Dude, got they, a don't real, they don't realize you get your guaranteed punish and then Reset the you, then you use that, that that situation to wake up and then you go for your mix-up, but you take your guaranteed damage. Absolutely. Great hold. You know, Crazy Steady, this is the final step, but Crazy Steady's not out of it. Great read by Crazy Steady, really applying the pressure here. Wow, what oh, a fuzzy. Yeah. What a fuzzy. Oh, sit down, stun. Guaranteed wow, three this, more this hits. It's going to hurt. It's yep. going to kill her. No. One more hit. And now Jackie, Jackie with those high-low mix-ups. Wow. Interruption, wow. critical stun. It is now set point. Here we crazy go. Steady. Let's see if this young blood Sonic Fox can pull it together. Here goes the sit down stun. Oh man, this is going to be hurt. He side teched off the wall. Good job. Wow, He's going to put it right back steady. in. It's just getting dominated right now by Sonic oh! Fox. Sonic Fox with oh! all the momentum right now going into the last round here. And that was guaranteed. That grab actually leaves Jackie in a sit down stun situation. Okay, this is it. Tournament life on the line. Sonic Fox got his back to the wall. He does not want to be there right now. Oh, very Great. nice hold. Reverses hold. positions. That's yep. huge. Tries to use the ground game. Oh, he's in the stun game. You don't want to be in the stun game against Crazy Steady. He's really good at it. Oh, good throw. Sonic Fox. He's got to make something right now. Uh-oh. No throw punish. No, I said, no that throw was huge. punish. That was huge. At that point in the life bar, you've you got have to punish that. Punish. Oh, this could throw. be it. He could grab him. He could What's all mix up. Here? Oh, my God. Oh, oh that this is, is it. This yeah, is it. Yeah, that's it. And the coveted Jackie. Wow. Yeah. Jackie. Yeah. Man, and that's what Crazy said he's saying right now. Yeah. He won. It's over. Wow. Wow. Sonic Fox, unfortunately, Youngblood, he was, he had a great weekend, two top eight placings, but unfortunately was not being able to get higher than that in either game. Man. All right. So, you know, we should really go over some of this here. The throw punishment. You know, we come from DOA four days where that's all you had. You had throw punish. If you didn't throw punish, you had nothing. In DOA 5 here, some of the times the players, they like to go for the stun mix-up because it's so rewarding with the power blow or the critical burst. So they try to go for the stun mix-up, but they don't understand, like, Crazy Steady, even though he won, he lost three rounds where all he had to do was hit A, guaranteed damage, back turn throws. Yeah, well, in reality, I think it's that new school mentality. I mean, in DOA 4, while the, you saw a lot of non-punishes simply because right. the throw game was not as significant as it is in this game. Absolutely. However, in this particular game, throw punishment is good. The damage is great. Right. It's actually a deterrent. But, but you, have to, you, have, you have to understand the mindset. If you are, if you really want to punish somebody, sure. Someone like Sonic Fox, yes. Just going for a mix-up is not a deterrent, right? Because they say, you know what? If you want to play the guessing game, I'll just guess right. I don't care. But when you start punishing something, they say, I can't do this. I, especially when the match is close, they say, I literally can't do this because I can't afford to lose this guarantee. Right, right. It's not even worth going for it because I know I'm going to yes. get grabbed and lose my health. And while you may think at the early stages of a match it doesn't mean anything, 
that is in the it mind does. of your opponent for the later stages of a match, and right. that is in their head, and it will literally change the way they want to play. Right, absolutely. I mean, you know, Crazy Steady won, and that's great. But when it comes to playing proper, sufficient DOA, not that his style's wrong. You can go for stun game, yes. fine. You can go for stun game, but you have to understand something, man. When that, that, that third to last round, when Christy was at 50% life, she throws forward, forward, kick, kick. No punish from Crazy Steady. Sonic Fox isn't scared. Yeah, he's like, you know, I'll throw it again. You're not even going to punish care, me. I don't care, because that just gives you something else to deal with. You have to literally make your opponent afraid, because in the closing seconds of a match, your opponent may say, I don't want to finish this string, because right. he's, he's going to grab it. Right, and here, this is going to be a really exciting match here. We have Master versus uh, um, Master, Mr. Quiggle. Mr. Mr. Quiggle, right? Yeah, yeah. Master versus Mr. Quiggle. Okay. I didn't hear you what. All right, and then the winner of this is going to be playing Excalibur Blades. All right, so getting on the way with this match here, this is a very interesting match because Christy is so punch strike dependent. Yes. And against someone like Hayabusa, I don't know. You know, I don't know if maybe.